Um, the main reason for me setting SBTV up was because I didn't feel like my mates were being put on a, on a mainstream platform. So I thought I wanted to create a platform for them to be able to express their views and opinions on the current state of the world and put it out online for people to watch. Um, but it main, mainly revolved around music? Yeah, mainly it was, it was born from the grime and the rap and the hip hop and the underground scene. Um, because that's what I was around. And I was an MC some time ago, so that's what I mainly focused on. But when it got to a certain level, that's when I wanted to branch out and start filming singers and start doing other things as well. Yeah. yeah. And who is on your list of people you've discovered then? Um, people that, I, I say people that I've sort of um, featured before in mainstream media, sort of got their hands on them, is people like Jesse J, Rita Ora, um, Emily Sande, Ed Sheeran, and then there's like, the underground rappers like Young and Crept and Kona and English Frank. So yeah, it's a bit of both. I try and marry it up. I don't try and feature loads of big artists, but really feature up and coming artists as well. Yeah, and you eventually this led to you getting your own re record label. Yeah, you? so then I had a label at Sony for a couple of years um, where I was able to bring more acts through. Um, but now I'm independent, now I'm doing it independent and just trying to build that. And finally, how are you going to feel going to see the Queen? Um, It'll be the second time going to see the Queen. That, that, that's sick. Um, I don't know, I'm overwhelmed. I can't wait. Should be fun.